Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you guys how you can take your Resolve videos and to export a single frame as an image that you can use as a thumbnail for YouTube videos or for similar purposes. So the idea is we're taking a single frame of the video and we're turning that into a JPEG image. And where we're going to do this is over on the color tab. So I'm going to go there now. It's the one with the little color wheel, third from the right. Here you're going to want to make sure that your clips window is open. So click on clips on the top right hand if it's not already open. And you're going to want to make sure that you are on the topmost video track. So on video track 2 I have a title. And you can see that while I have video track 2 selected that we can see both the title and the background footage. But if I go click on video track 1, we only see the background footage. So that's why you need to click on the topmost track so that you can see the topmost title and everything that goes below it as well. So making sure that you're on the topmost video track, you need to go and find the frame of your video where you want to take a thumbnail from. I'm pretty much going to select the frame where the title is on screen but hasn't started fading out yet. So for me, that's here right around one second and nine or 10 frames. And to generate a still, which is just a single frame of your video, you need to right click on the preview window and choose grab still. So when you have these stills in your media gallery, you can take them and export them anywhere on your computer that you want. So I can right click on the still and choose export. When you do that, you're going to get a standard file explorer pop-up window. And we're going to need to set a file name and a save type for this file. So we don't want it to be a .dpx file but rather we want it to export the still as either a JPEG image or a PNG image. Unless you need an alpha channel in your image for some reason, JPEG is going to give you a smaller file size. So I'm going to choose to export as JPEG. And now I just need to give this a name. So I will call this thumbnail example .jpeg. Hit export. And now if we check the desktop, we have two files that have been exported here, the .jpeg file and this .drx file, which includes information about the still. Uh, but we can actually just completely discount that for right now because all we care about is having the thumbnail. So we can open up the .jpg image to see that it is exported exactly how we want. It looks like the frame of the video from DaVinci Resolve, which is what we expect. So now you can take this JPEG image and upload it when you're prompted to on sites like YouTube for a thumbnail, or you can take it into GIMP, do a little bit more editing to it, such as adding a logo to it. And that's really all there is to it for extracting a thumbnail JPEG image from DaVinci Resolve 16 straight from within the app. So I've been Chris, I hope you found this basic tutorial helpful, and I will see you guys in my future video content.